Capaldi viewers, Brad prior to our Barstool Entertainment, doing another Red Dead Redemption 2 video. Even though I did the end credits video before this, I still have plenty of footage that I want to edit together and make a few more videos. This one is showing some locations within Red Dead Redemption 2 that I didn't cover. And actually, if you find a, a location, a hidden location, you know, where John or Arthur draw in the sketchbook, and you find some cabins along the way and explore those cabins, those count toward 100%. So I'm going to show you some other locations that will help you out. And if you're trying to get 100%, this is where you need to go. Now, this location is actually one of those where um, John will sketch in his book, and it's some mammoth bones here. And I'll show you on the map where it's going to be located. Yeah, the Mammoth Bones are located on the map right here where the player is. And it's by Dead Boot Creek and Spider Gorge. Now the next place I'm going to show you is a cabin which is not too far from the Mammoth Bones. This is the Dorman Crest Shack. And... You can investigate the shack here. You go inside, and it looks abandoned. Now, you can steal some stuff and look around. It's just a small shack. But what's interesting is if you go and follow this trail, it looks like someone walked away from the shack for some reason. And if you use John's tracking skills, you will notice that there is tracks left by a stranger, and you can follow them, and you got to follow them for a really long time, so I'm going to fast forward it, but it comes to an end. In the end, it comes to this guy. He's frozen to death, and yeah, it's just it's kind of a sad thing. And it's probably the guy by the name of Dorman, and I can't stop tracking him. But you can pick up the carbine repeater. It's nothing special, but it's not worn. It's not damaged or anything. And you can pick it up. Uh, you can't loot the guy. This is all you really get. And then you got to run back to the cabin. What I find interesting is even though the occupant of the cabin is probably dead, lights are on, and, well, they didn't have timers and electricity back then. The bed looks, well, I think it's occupied, but you can't sleep in it. So you might as well just search around the cabin and see what you can get. Premium cigarettes, uh, nothing hidden in the... Uh, fireplace like some things are but you got stuff around here not a lot just cigarettes and well yeah nothing really there I probably missed something but if I did yeah nothing's triggering nothing's happening that's it for this cabin well okay some canned salmon yippee mm, yummy again nothing so on to the next location. Actually, I'll show you on the map. It's right here. Dorman Crest. Right near the Mammoth. This is actually a location of a weapon that you can pick up. And you can find various weapons around. It's near the Wapati um, Indian Reservation. But this is the location for the ancient tomahawk. You can pick it up. It's a 
decent weapon. It's, I don't know if it's better than the uh, standard tomahawk you can throw. But again, it's not too far from the Wapati Indian Reservation. And let's see if I can show you on the map. Right here, uh, right where the player is, again, not too far. And it's near Calumet Ravine. It's just stuck in one of the tree stumps. This one is a little overlooked, and you got to ride off trail, but you find the Witch's Cauldron, and I advise you to give it a shot, give it a try, take a drink. Now, it obviously doesn't kill you. What it does is it raises all your core um, traits, your health, stamina, and dead eye. They're all raised to the maximum level. And it's right here, which is Cauldron. It's above the N, and yeah, you can find it on the map. But again, it doesn't kill you. And... I can run around here a little bit. I was looking for some other things. There's supposed to be some rare orchids or something. But I'm going to move on to something else. And of course, yep, oh, here, this is why. I better not leave yet. In here, there is this chest. And you open it up. And there's some bourbon and hair tonic. Awesome. Right? Bourbon and hair tonic. This next one is Fairvale Shanty. I believe I came here with Arthur at some point, and there is some nice treasure. I will want to see if it resets here. This is interesting. Jewelry, a platinum pocket watch, and a gold nugget. Like I said, I visited this with Arthur Morgan and Fair Vale Shanty. I'm wondering if all the treasure boxes reset because that would be kind of cool. I mean, if you know where they're located, you can make more money for John. I thought once you empty the treasure box, that was it. It's over. And this is another cabin. You can kind of find it. And it is some stuff lying around here. Inspect the letter. Um, it says, uh, letter to Martha from Garfield. Dearest Martha, blah, 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 blah. You got some gin and some premium cigarettes. Mmm, yummy. Breakfast of champions, I guess. Uh, yeah, I can sell some of this stuff. You look around, there's take open miracle tonic. Check the side table out. You know, basically loot the place. Because all these cabins, yeah, they're very lootable. And there's 
plenty of fun stuff in them if you are able to get into them. I can't for some reason... Yeah, I'm just going to close the damn side drawer here because it's driving me nuts. Come on, close. Yep, kick it shut there. And I want to see if I can... Nope, I can't grab any of this crap. Let's check under the fireplace mantle. Nothing there. Ah, canned veggies. Gotta love canned veggies. They are awesome. And we got some biscuits. Mmm, yum, 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 yum. And I'm thinking that's it. That's it for this cabin here. Um, did I? Yeah, gotta check here. Mmm, jewelry. Oh, platinum pocket watch. Awesome. Yeah, close the drawer. I can't open anything else. Um, same drawer. Close it again. Gonna move on. Right, nothing here. Open drawer, nightstand. Nope, nothing here. And I missed that door. That's the door outside. And stupid me, I gotta run around outside because there's actually some rare orchids around here that you can find and... Who cares, because they're not really good. You can't do the exotics with John. After running around, I decide to enter the cabin and look around some more. There's the other door. Oh, nothing here. Got to get to the other door, John. Other door. Other door. Yeah, I'm controlling them, and I'm just standing here. Oh, wait, there's a body. Uh, nightstand already investigated that, not that drawer, door, uh, yeah, nothing here, I've already done this, yeah, oh, wow, here's the bedroom, let's see what we can find here, Over here on this nightstand, if you had the quest item, there would be a hand mirror, which um, I believe one of your fellow gang members asks you for, if you could find one. And again, this nightstand would have the hand mirror, other than the jewelry. And there is no hand mirror here, just a flask. And that's it. That's it for this. And the cabin is... Martha's Swain or something like that. I'll probably show you on the map here. Whoa, open the door and there's Martha. Yeah, okay, dead body. Saw that before. Um, I don't know if she died or killed herself, but this is her cabin. And again, I see nothing here. And I'll get outside here and hopefully show you the location on the map, which, yeah, I, it's just one of those where I'm a little slow here. I was looking for stuff. But on the map here, Martha's Swain. And now we can move on to the next location. This is in Butcher's Creek. And... If you walk around the area where they are butchering a pig, you find a pig mask. Yeah, I'm not going to worry about the hat or the hat because once I get back on my mount, well, then I can switch back to the uh whatever it is, the death roll uh outfit. So, let's move on to the next location. One of the final locations I want to show you here on the map is called Register Rock. You can zoom right by it while you're riding and it's not too far from Emerald Creek and the oil field. And I'm going to inspect it. John's going to draw his little scribbles. Yeah, he's not very good at drawing, is he? I mean, he's okay, but 
this is Register Rock, and it is one of the final locations. Hey. Why am I not showing you Let's on the go. map? Yeah. Okay, I had to do a little editing. But right here is Register Rock. As you can see, it's just below the H in New Hanover, near the Heartland Oil Fields, and not too far from Emerald Ranch. That's the final location I wanted to show you, and this is hopefully the final locations video. Well, I shouldn't say hopefully. I might find some stuff edited together and make one more. But it is, for now, the final location video. I'm Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button. Feel free to leave some comments. If you like this type of video, well, hit the subscribe button and bell icon, and you will be informed because I post four video game related videos a week, plus some specials and some shorts, and you don't want to miss out. As always, thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and thanks for stopping by.